Okay, here's something interesting. In this simple demonstration, we will see how $334 were accumulated in only one hour. I've heard about this simple system which has only three short steps and decided to give it a try. I will now show you this method that I saw and used and you too will be able to use it. So right now you might be wondering what is this method exactly and how does it work? It's a trading system based on binary options. Binary options are very simple to understand and use because all they require is one decision to predict whether an asset would go up or down. Once you choose one of the two options, the trade can begin. The trade is fast, it lasts between 5-30 minutes, and once the time is up, your position would automatically close. If your choice was right, you will profit between 170% to 190%. So how will you know if to choose up or down? We're going to use a very simple method that is used by professional traders called Graphic Trends Analysis. According to the system I saw, there is a higher probability that an asset will continue its direction rather than reverse it, and we can analyze its graphs and recognize its trends. There are three main types of trends. An uptrend, a declining trend and a neutral trend. Now I'll do my best to demonstrate what these trends are all about. Here's an example of a binary broker account where you can see step by step the idea of trends analysis. Obviously you'll have to create a new account for yourself to try this method on. The concept is the same for all of the binary brokers shown at the bottom of the site. As you can see there are $14,079.03 in this account. I first saw the system two months ago and it seems best to start with $500, but you can begin with less. Now let's see how this system I'm talking about really works. In the binary platform, you have many assets to choose from. You got stocks, currencies, indices, and commodities. Once you've chosen your asset, you need to choose its direction. The direction can either be up or down. Notice the timer as a trade lasts between 5 to 30 minutes. So now I will perform trades according to the method of trends monitoring and you'll be able to see the principles of the system and how they are applied. In the site on the first step under the video there is a link. To recognize trends use the real time graphics available here. Once you click on the link a new page opens with the assets graphs. The web page can take up to a minute and a half to load because it contains all of the graphs that you will need. So now we will identify trends in these graphs in order to trade in the binary platform. We have here our first currency, the US dollar versus the Japanese yen. As you can clearly see, its trend line is very positive and clear. And we can see that it's going up from this point, right about here, all the way up to this point, right about here. So you can identify this as an upwards going trend line. Since we have our analysis, we go back to the platform and choose the US dollar versus the Japanese yen from our list. We choose the expiration hour and I'm going to click 10 for now. And since it's going up, we click up and enter a hundred dollars, click apply and approve the option. Once you see the trade confirmation, you're good to go. We go back to the graphs and continue to the euro versus the Japanese yen. Now this line as well is going from this point all the way up here, which means we have another positive trend line. Once we have our analysis, we go back to the platform. We look for the euro versus the Japanese yen. There we go. We choose our expiration hour. We click up since it's going up. Enter a hundred dollars. Once again, we click apply and approve the option. Exit the trade confirmation and go back to the graphs. Our third graph is the Great Britain Pound versus the Japanese Yen. Now this graph as well is going from this point all the way up here. It might be going down a bit here but it doesn't mean it's a declining trend line. Since we have our analysis we go back to the platform, choose the Great Britain Pound versus the Japanese Yen from the list, 
um, there we go we choose the expiration hour and since it's going up we click up enter a hundred dollars click apply and approve we'll wait for the trade confirmation to show up there we go we exit and go back to the graphs we continue on to the Australian dollar versus the Japanese yen this as well is a beautiful upwards going trend line going from this point all the way up here and according to the system I saw we should treat it just like any other upwards going trend line since we have our analysis we go back to the platform we choose the Australian dollar versus the Japanese yen from the list and there we go since it's going up we click up enter a hundred dollars we apply and once again approve our option we we'll wait for the trade confirmation and exit after that we go back to the graphs now it's needless to say that we can analyze a downwards going trend line just the same as we analyze an upwards going trend line it makes no real difference to us and I will now show you how you can see here that the oil is a downwards going trend line you can see that it's going from this point up here but then it goes all the way down here so it's a downwards going trend line and it's pretty obvious so since we have our analysis we go back to the platform we choose the oil from the list in the commodities section there we go choose our expiration hour since it's going down this time we're going to click down enter the same amount $100 apply and approve like I said no real difference just like the up was going trend line now we go back to the graphs and right here we have the silver commodity which is also a downwards going trend line starting from this point going all the way down here since we have our analysis we go back to the platform choose the silver commodity from the list since it's going down we click down enter a hundred dollars apply our option and approve we exit the trade confirmation and go back to the graphs our next graph is the euro versus the swiss franc now what you see before you is the neutral trend line we have no idea what this is it's neither going up or down is very unclear and very unsafe Instead, we'll move on and continue analyzing other graphs. An example of a good graph is the Swiss franc versus the Japanese yen you see to the right. It's beautiful upwards going from this point all the way up here. It's an upwards going trend line. Since we have our analysis, we go back to the platform and search for the Swiss franc versus the Japanese yen in our list. and it appears that we don't have the Swiss franc versus the Japanese yen currency in this platform so now would be a good time to remind you that it's important to have an account at two or three binary brokers so if a certain asset is missing from one you'll have it in the other that way you'll maximize your experience by trading simultaneously on several brokers so since we don't have the currency we're gonna keep on going and go back to the graphs by now we have opened six positions and I'm going to open one more position which would be a stock. I will now show you how to choose a stock and identify its graph. We have here the stock section of the site and we can see the Apple stock displayed. As you can see the Apple stock doesn't have a very good trend line. So I'm going to stay away from this one and search for a stock with a better trend line in the search bar. I have already done this and found one. You will need to do the same. In the meanwhile, let's enter the Vodafone stock. You can see that it suggests the stock already. Once you click the suggestion, you'll be able to see the stock's trend line. The Vodafone stock has a beautiful downwards going trend line. You can see it starting from this point going up a bit and then all the way down here it's a downwards going trend line once we have our analysis we go back to the platform we choose the Vodafone stock from the stock section there we 
we go. We choose our expiration hour, 10 o'clock. And since it's going down, we're going to click down, enter a hundred dollars, click apply, and approve. Just like the other commodities and currencies, the stocks are the same. So by now, we have opened in total seven positions following the significant trends shown by the graphs. Right here in the table, we can see all of our open positions. We can also see when they are going to expire. Our expiration hour is 10 o'clock. I will now have to speed up the time of the video. We won't have to wait all that time. So I will now scroll up for you to see the clock running. I will speed it up until 3 seconds before the positions expire. Once they expire, we will see how much we have won and how much we've lost. So after speeding up the time of the video, our options are going to expire in about 3 seconds and I will start scrolling down so you can see the results. By now, all of our positions have expired and can be viewed in the expired positions section of the table, as you can see before you. In total, we won 6 positions out of the available 7 and lost only 1, which is the Great Britain Pound versus the Japanese Yen currency. It is very important to remind you that it is perfectly normal to lose on some positions, and no trader in the world can only gain. The purpose of this method is to win with the majority of the positions. So from these 6 wins, I have earned in total $334 in less than an hour.